Hey, what's going on, ladies and gents? Welcome back to another Genshin Impact video. I'm going to be talking about Zhao's rerun. Everyone has been asking in the community, not specifically to me, but I'm going to be answering it today in this video. So, guys, Zhao's rerun might not be coming as soon as you think. Let me just tell you about it real quick. But before I get into the video, guys, consider liking this video as well as subscribing to the channel if you do enjoy this type of content. It lets me know uh, by... You know, like him subscribing, so that's kind of cool. But yeah, Zhao's rerun might just be coming in February. Why well, I think it's be it's coming in February? So I, I think we won't see a rerun for Zhao until it's the Lantern Rite event. Yes, guys, the same thing that happened this year with the Lantern Rite event, and they released Zhao at the same time. This would make sense if they did the same thing for next year. So if February comes along and the Lantern Ride event is happening, we'll see a Zhao rerun for sure. Right now, I don't see a Zhao rerun happening in the foreseeable future. All right, let me show you guys my uh, copium build that I have on Zhao. So he's currently running the Black Cliff Pole. I do not have the Primordial Jade Spear or even the Staff of Home. I don't have either of those. Um, he's running the two-piece Verdescent along with the Shimano set. Shimano set is re like pretty easy to farm, but I don't really have a good crit damage headpiece yet. So I'm gonna gonna ho hope to get a good one in the future. Yeah. Zero constellations, his talents is 968. Uh I'm still deciding whether or not I should get his um his ultimate to be crowned here. Or maybe even his normal attack. But either way, super cool character. This is his current stat. Obviously, this the crit rate should be improved here, but I think it's fine for now, I suppose. Pretty good character. I love his design. I love everything about him. And uh, yeah. So yeah, let's just take out some of these guys using my boy Zhao here. And uh, yeah, just see how he does. All right. Boom. Boom. So the current team I'm running is uh, nice to have because... <laughs> Yeah, as you can see, he just like 2 E's and he destroys everyone. It's nice to have because um, it's easy to get energy recharged with this. Especially if you have Gene on the 4th slot. I have Bennett because, uh, you know, power buff or whatever. I guess I should have played with Bennett, but it's fine. <laughs> as you guys can see, uh, he wiped out the field pretty quickly there. And now, I just have the little extra movement to make him go faster. Alright, we're going to be testing out Zhao. Well... Further testing, I suppose, with his damage from the bounties that we're about to do here. Got the first bounty over here. I love Inazuma bounties because you pretty much just have to whack opponents a bunch of times <laughs> to finish it. So, let's just do that really quickly. And, uh, yeah, let's get started. Do one of these. And, alright. There it is. It's order, baby. And boom, boom. <laughs> you got half its HP already. And the nice thing about Beto is just you can spam this, right? That's pretty much it. <laughs> Alright. We're gonna get his ult. We're gonna get Zhao's ultimate. And we're gonna... Oh. You know, just had a little miscommunication with me and Zhao, you know? Sometimes uh, he just wants to do his own thing, you know? He's, you know, a Yaksha or whatever adept is. Um, so it makes sense that he wanted to do his own thing, and that's fine, that's totally fine now. Yeah. But, uh, maybe, maybe he'll, uh, cooperate this time, you know? Maybe, just, just, you know, maybe. Alright, do one of these. Dash, dash. Alright, alright, relax, relax, whoa, relax. Alright. Boom. And there we go. Now... We get some big boy damage. Oh, come on. Alright, we gotta read this one, alright? It says that the defense is decreased after a plunging attack. So, make sure you guys keep that in mind. That's only if I don't kill him too quick. Alright, there we go. Do one of these. Get a little bit more of those. Alright, well, I can't really... In can I get some orbs, please? There we go. A little bit more. Just a little bit. Alright, there we go. And <laughs> the, the boost ran out, or the the buff. But I mean, it's still pretty good damage either way, you know? I'm not critting here, because I have 63 ult, not ult, but crit rate. 
But no, uh, yeah, as much as the strongest character in the <laughs> I'm just kidding. I mean, he definitely could be one of the strongest if built correctly with a good team or whatever. But that could be said about any character. So don't be like baited by all these, you know, individuals or YouTubers that do like 100,000 damage per hit or whatever. And uh, you're going to be, you know, enticed to summon, enticed to want to get that character. But you don't have to. All right. Let me be the first to tell you that. You don't have to get it. Um, he is an awesome character, in my opinion. He is absolutely amazing his design his backstory background whatever it is you want to call it pretty cool i love this character a lot he's my first character that i did build so i do have some maybe some nostalgia about that factor but anyways his rerun won't be coming out too soon Xiao's going to be coming in the future hopefully with a nice rerun but it's going to be all the way in february or mid february rather and it's going to be with the lantern ride event I just don't see him coming anytime sooner just because of how Genshin is ending to how they release their characters or their reruns. So if we were to see a Zhao rerun, it would be all the way in February. But yeah, that's going to be it for me. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, consider liking this video as well, subscribing to the channel. See you guys in the next video very soon. Goodbye.